So there's this new trend going around. I know I'm kind of late talking about it, but apparently these days you can be an influencer just kind of by being at places where things happen. For instance, we got a uh, Tanya Totiddy or whatever. The, I don't know who these influencers are, but she's over here holding up a power drill like she's about to nail the not nail screw the board in. She's probably never held one of those in her life. But the good part about this video is that she said, Thank you so much. Sets makes it all better. Then she gets back into her car that her boyfriend probably bought her and drives away like she actually did something that day. Now keep in mind, being an influencer doesn't necessarily mean that's a good thing. You know, like Hitler was an influencer, but he wasn't influencing very good things. This isn't really influencing anything though, except for like how good you are, but it kind of doesn't matter because here is fate. Then over here in this next video, we got Brianna Big Butt over here who probably was just walking down the sidewalk, saw the T-Mobile with a smash in the windows, and said, ah, take a picture of me, make sure you get my butt in there, and figured, okay, we'll get tons of views off this. Once again, not really influencing anything. Like, I don't know, what am I supposed to see this, the photo that that guy's taking? What am I going to see? I'm like, whoa, shit, better go fix up some T-Mobiles. Even after when she finishes taking a video, she just looks very annoyed about it. Like, I don't have to waste my time with this garbage. But yeah, that's all I wanted to talk about for this video. See ya.